The Thinkcat website is very easy to research by using Google. And in the web official website, choose draw now, and then choose um, country and your birthday. Not in view is okay. And the next step is choose next, and then enter an email address as uh, your login ID, and create a password. And agree to terms of service. Use your email address as a username and type in your password you create. And then press sign in. You may see that I've already created some design in my page. Don't worry, you're going to create a new one by press create new design. You may see that there's a graph paper at the center of your page. First of all, press right button of your mouse, and you may change the view angle of your graph paper like this. And you may make use of the navigation button to control the graph paper. You may drag an object from the right to the left. I'm going to create a grip and a spear right here. Now you may use your mouse wheel to zoom in or zoom out, like this. If you want to move your object upward or downward, you just have to select an object and then pass the arrow, pass an object and move it horizontally like this. You may also pass on the empty space to unselect an object. You may find that my uh, spear and the cube is not aligned correctly. So here comes a shortcut for you. First of all, select two objects and then choose align function in the function bar. Pass on the this dot and also this dot and you may find that it merge together in a perfect position. First of all, select the hemisphere and then choose hole like this. And then select the whole object and choose rope. And you may see that there's a hole created at the top of the crib. You may ungroup the object like this by pressing the ungroup button. The color of all the objects is not uh, important. It just shows you whether the two objects are merged together or not. After you merge an object, you may adjust the position of the two objects together.
you may use Ctrl C and Ctrl V button to duplicate another object. You may press delete key to delete an object. You may also make use of the copy and paste function on the function bar to do the same function. You may duplicate two objects by select two objects and then copy and then paste like this. The undo and redo button can help you to return to the previous step. You may also name your production by pass the name here and then we name it like this. Hope you would enjoy my teaching video. Bye bye.